Haven't stopped eating, baby. Still got it. Welcome back to Short Sports. I'm Chuck Maxwell. Today is November 25th, and we have the fakest news in sports. The 2022 World Cup in Qatar is now officially underway amid several controversies, including a last-minute decision by the host country to ban beer sales at its stadium. And if you think that's messed up, wait until you hear about what they do to people who actually work at the stadium. Tom Brady said on his podcast, Let's Go, this week that the holidays are always time for family, and by family he means Rob Gronkowski. Las Vegas Raiders linebacker Blake Martinez announced his retirement just weeks after selling a rare Pokemon card for nearly $700,000. The team canceled practice the next day as the rest of the Raiders were desperately digging through boxes in their parents' attics. A hand-colored Calvin and Hobbes cartoon by creator Bill Watterson sold at an auction last week for a record-breaking $480,000, the same amount James Harden will likely spend at the strip club this weekend. Thanksgiving weekend will be even more football-centric next year as the NFL has announced a Black Friday game in 2023. While players will undoubtedly be going all out in the nationally televised contest, the game is still expected to be significantly less violent than actual Black Friday shopping. For everyone at Short Sports, I'm Chuck Maxwell. We'll see you next time.